Hi, this is a video to help you navigate the Canvas site for Paul 120. So let me go ahead and share my screen so you can, so we can take a look at the Canvas site together. Okay, so there's the screen and this is what your, this is what your Canvas site looks like. Um, that on the side here are where you're gonna find any assignments that we're doing this semester, the discussions that we're doing. Um, you'll also find your grades here. So you can keep track of your grades. Okay, those are and, and announcements. So you can take a look at announcements and they are there throughout the course of the semester. So you can look at them if you wanna like refresh your memory on something that I might've said. So let's just click on assignments there to get a sense of what you're gonna see in assignments. Uh, and so in assignments, you'll see all the reading quizzes that we're taking this semester. You will be taking um, two quizzes each week. So each week you take a quiz that's over the readings for that week, but you will also be watching um, lectures. Here are the lecture quizzes. And so I post um, video lectures and you will be watching and listening to those and you'll take quizzes uh, on those. In the video um, overview for the class, I mentioned that you're gonna be writing three papers. And so here you can see the papers and the assignments are already right there. So let's say if you, for the frontline episode, you could just click on that and it tells you about the purpose and the instruction uh, and how the paper will be evaluated, et cetera. So all of that is already up there at the, the beginning of the semester. As are um, the discussions that we're gonna be doing, Right now, the discussions are listed and there are dates for when you're going to be taking those discussions, but some of the materials for the actual questions for the discussion, the readings have been selected, but I'm still working on creating the questions for those discussions and those will be up soon. Let's go back to the home button here and this gives you a sense of how our course is organized. So in this first module, it's called Welcome to Political to the Politics of Crime and Punishment. Here you're gonna find my contact information, the syllabus and the course schedule are here. So if you press on course syllabus, for example, there it is and you can read it, it's a page, um, but then there's also, if you wanna print off the syllabus, you there's a, a word version of the syllabus and you can take a look at that printed off in case you would like a paper version of that. Uh, there's guidelines for how to do the online instruction or the online discussions suggestions for how to be um, successful in this course, and also contact information and information about um, how I can be contacted and office hours as well. So make sure that for this first week that you read through all of this information, including the course syllabus and the course schedule and due dates. Now, when you look at the rest of it, so that's just the, uh, the general information for the course. Beyond that, there is a module for each week. And so for this first week, you'll see that it's the introduction to the course. And this is kind of an onboarding uh, week uh, where you will be, um, at, if you press on the weekly overview, there's some commentary. Every week you'll have some written commentary to read. And then it'll always tell you what you'll, the tasks that you're gonna be doing this week. And oftentimes I will just put a video overview of what you're gonna be learning that week. Um, and so for each week, they're sort of organized, very, not sort of, but they're organized similarly. Um, you get a weekly overview and then you get to take, you take a quiz, you might participate in, in a discussion. This week, you're gonna be participating in a self-introduction discussion and you're gonna be taking a get to know you questionnaire so I can get some more information from you. Uh, and that's basically how each of the weeks are organized. Um, that topic one, it all of the weeks start on a Wednesday at midnight and they end on a Tuesday at 11.59 p.m. That's when at least some of your items are due, but not all of them. And you'll see that that is how it's organized throughout the semester. If we're having a discussion, it'll show up in the module. If you have a paper due, it'll show up in the module. So you kind of work your way down the, um, down the, the, um, the, uh, 
the uh, modules there. If you hear screaming in the background, it's because the Packers game is on and my neighbors next door have a television in their backyard and a big outdoor party because of COVID, but they're still celebrating. And so uh, there's still cause to celebrate for this game. And as you can hear it in the background. Uh, so anyways, that's how the, the, uh, the uh, Canvas site is organized. I will say that when you look at the Canvas site, you will only see it week by week. So the first week, you'll only see the introduction to the course week and the other material is hidden. It's all there and ready to go. I just, um, or I, the way I do my courses is I just have you focus on week by week. I don't want you to work ahead. In fact, you really can't work ahead. And so at, on Wednesday of every week at midnight, the new course module, the topic module will open and all the lectures and everything will be available for you. If you do wanna read ahead, you can take a look at the course schedule. Um, on the course schedule, it tells you what all the readings are and when all the things are due are. So if you do wanna get ahead on reading, you can um, follow the course schedule up there. Um, but every Wednesday, a new module will open. Okay, so um, that is uh, kind of an overview of how the, uh, Canvas courses is organized. So hopefully this is helpful. If you have any other questions, just text me, drop me an email, give me a call, and um, I will talk to you again soon.